हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू सी सैट मंत्रा वेलकम टू अवर डेली डोज ऑफ सॉल्व क्वेश्चन टू एनरोल इन अवर कोर्स कैंडली विजिट सी सैट मंत्रा डॉट कॉम फॉर मोर सॉल्व क्वेश्चन एंड कॉन्सेप्ट कैंडली ज्वाइन अवर टेलीग्राम चैनल बोथ द लिंक्स आर गिवन बिलो इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन द रेशियो ऑफ ए टू डिजिट नेचुरल नंबर टू ए नंबर फॉर्मड बाई रिवर्सिंग इट्स डिजिट इज फोर इज टू सेवन द नंबर ऑफ सच पेज इज This question is from number system chapter based on decimal system. It is asked in 2019 from decimal system every year one or two questions will be asked my friends and they will be of same type two digit natural number reversing its digits otherwise three digit natural number reversing its digits. So questions will be like this only okay decimal system concept is very very important kindly go through that lecture from number system chapter. See, we have a two-digit natural number. Let's assume that natural number as x, y, two digits, my friends. Okay. Now I can write this number in decimal system as x into ten power one, y into ten power zero. Okay. This is ten x plus y. Okay. Ten power zero is one. So y into one is y. Okay. Now we are forming a number by reversing its digits. Okay. Y x. I have reversed the digits. Now this is y into ten power one, x into ten power zero. Okay, this is ten y plus x. Okay, ten power one is ten, so ten y. Ten power zero is one, so one into x is x, my friends. Okay. See, this is how we represent any number in decimal system, my friends. Okay, this is one's position. One is ten power zero. This is ten's position. Ten is ten power one. Okay. Similarly, this is one's position. Ten power zero. This is tens position, ten power one. Clear, right? Now the ratio of this number to this number, okay, is four is to seven. So ten x plus y by ten y plus x is equal four by seven. Now doing cross multiplication, seven into ten x plus y is equal four into ten y plus x, okay. Now this is seventy x plus seven y is equal forty y plus four x. Now bringing all x terms one side and the y terms another side, my friends. Clear, right? This is sixty six x is equal to thirty three y. Okay, thirty three one za thirty three two za. Okay, so two x is equal to y. X by y is equal to one by two. Okay, I brought. To this side and y this side, so x by y is equal to one by two. Now x by y is equal to one by two. Now we want number of such pairs. See from this statement, from this sentence, we got this condition. Now we want x and y which satisfy this condition. Okay. Now x and y cannot be greater than nine, my friends. If they are greater than nine. Then this number cannot be a two-digit natural number. Okay, it will be three digit or four digits. So x and y should be less than or equal to nine. Okay, they cannot be greater than nine. Now let's look at x and y values which satisfy this condition. Okay, one is one by two. I am writing this one by two as one into one by one into two. I just multiplied the numerator and denominator with one, my friends. No problem, right? Now let's multiply the numerator and denominator with two. Okay, two into one by two into two. See, this is one by two only. Okay, because two two gets cancelled. Now this number is two into one is two. Two into two is four. So this is one more possibility. Now let's multiply the numerator with three and denominator with three. See, the ratio is one by two because three three gets cancelled. Now this is three by six. Okay. Now this is also one possibility. Now let's multiply the numerator with four and denominator with four. Okay, this is four by eight. See the ratio is one by two. This is also one possibility. Now let's multiply the numerator with five and denominator with five. Okay, this is five by ten. See two digit, but a y cannot be greater than nine, right? So this cannot be one such pair because y is a two digit number. Y should be single digit number, my friends. Okay. So possible such pairs are one by two, two by four, three by six, four by eight. Okay, so four such pairs. Okay, x and y can be one comma two or two comma four, three comma six or 
4 comma 8 my friends okay so there are four such pairs possible b is our answer see for number of possible such pairs okay you could have just written like this rather than going in this manner but sometimes if you go like this you may miss out some number here you are building the pairs in a proper manner there won't be any chance of missing okay that's why i have gone in a proper logical manner okay rather than going haphazard manner trial and error manner okay to know more about the course kindly visit csatmantra.com for course or concept related queries kindly message at our telegram number or mail at this email id thank you